ಕುಂಜ ಜೋನಾರತಿ ಕೇಳಿ ಸಿದ್ಧೈ ಜಾಜಾಲಿ ವಿದ್ಯುಕ್ತಿರಪೇಕ್ಷಣೀಯ ಕುಂಜ ಜೋನಾರತಿ ಕೇಳಿ ಸಿದ್ಧೈ ಜಾಜಾಲಿ ವಿದ್ಯುಕ್ತಿರಪೇಕ್ಷಣೀಯ
अनर्पित चरिंग चिरात करुणयावती न कलौ समर्पयत उन्नत उज्जल रसांग सभक्ति श्याम हरी पुरट सुंदर द्युति कदम संदीपिता सदा हृदय कंदरे सुरथु ब सचिनंदन दिस इज द ब्लेसिंग्स ऑफ श्रील रूप को श्यामी अपॉन एवरी वन श्री चैतन्य मनोभिष्टम स्थापित जैन भूतले स्वयं रूप कदा मई हम ददा शपदांति विशो प्रे टू रूपक श्यामी और हिज ब्लेसिंग सो दैट वी कैन अंडरस्टैंड वट इज दी एक्चुअल पोजिशन ऑफ श्री चैतन्य महा श्री चैतन्य महाप्रभु इज ए मोस्ट मार्सीफुल इनकारनेशन टू बेस्टो अपन एस कृष्ण प्रेम श्रील रूप गोस्वामी अंडरस्टूड इट शीला सार्वभौम भट्टाचार्य understood it and we should take their view point of view uh, what they have studied about sri chaitanya mahaprabhu so sri rupa goswami says in the beginning sri chaitanya mahaprabhu was appreciated by shila rupa ko shami as mahavadan navata there are many incarnations of krishna keshava dhrita meena sharira jay jagadish hare keshava dhrita nishinga rupa jay jagadish many incarnations but this incarnation श्री चैतन्य महाप्रभु इज अनर्पित चरिंग चिरा द मार्सी ऑफ दिस इनकारनेशन इज अनलिमिटेड इट वॉज नेवर गिवन बिफोर दैट इज श्री चैतन्य महाप्रभु मार्सी ही डिस्ट्रीब्यूटेड द मोस्ट कॉन्फिडेंशियल पार्ट ऑफ लव ऑफ गॉड एट Uh, although we are living in this fallen age kolijo uh, but he is giving the top most platform of loving krishna anat pita charin chira hmm. therefore he is supposed to be the most munificent incarnation namo mahavadana krishna prema pradaya he is giving directly krishna pray uh, it is very difficult to understand krishna and what to speak of his loving affairs it is very difficult manushya naam sahasre sukasti jadati siddha hai jadatam api siddhyan ha kasti betti maam tat krishna personally say that it is very difficult to understand actually it is so Uh, <coughs> but Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu's mercy is so uh, unlimited that he is helping not only to understand Krishna, but also he is giving directly love of Krishna. And this supermost platform of love, as it was experienced by the gopis. the gopi is dealing with krishna is considered to be the top most uh, uh, <coughs> chaitanya mahaprabhu he recommended ramma kachi dupasana brajabadhu varga bhija kalpita brajabadhu the gopis the dancers of navan uh, they worship krishna 
and the topmost uh, love, loving affairs, they did not know anything but Krishna. Uh, for Krishna they could sacrifice anything, their honor, their prestige, uh, everything, their husband, their uh, sons, family, that is the gopis, standard. <coughs> Therefore, uh, Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu's incarnation is accepted by Srila Rupa Goswami in many verses, one of the verses is here, Anat Pita Charing Chira, Karunaya Bhati Nakalo. So we should take shelter of Krishna Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. That is the blessing of Rupa Goswami. He says, Hari Purata Sundara Dhuti Kadamma Sandhi Pita Sada Aridaya Kandare Suratu Vasa Chinanda. He is giving his blessing that this form of the Supreme Personality of Godhead, Hari, may always remain within you, on the core of your heart. If we simply keep Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu uh, within our heart, then it will be very easy to understand what is Krishna. Uh, because if you understand Krishna, then your life is success. Janma karma cha dibbam me jujana That is only. Our Krishna consciousness movement means just try to understand Krishna. Then your life is successful. Uh, Krishna says, Anyone who understands me, uh, why I come here, what is my activity, tatta uh, dehaṁ punarjana, he becomes liberated. After giving up this body, he does not accept any material body. In his own spiritual body, he goes back to home, back to God. This is our Krishna concept. So, uh, if you don't go through Sri Krishna Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, it will be very difficult to understand Krishna. Uh, that is practical. Just like you, young boys and <coughs> girls from Western countries, you have taken up Krishna so seriously. Why? Because we are trying to understand Krishna through Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. So we should follow this principle. There will be no difficulty to understand Krishna. And as soon as you understand Krishna, your life is successful. Of course we cannot understand Krishna fully as far as possible. At least if we understand that Krishna is the Supreme Personality of God. This much is sufficient. This much is sufficient. Uh, Krishna su Bhagavan Sayam. <coughs> Krishna says in the Bhagavad Gita, Matta Paratanam Nanya Kinti Jasti Dhananya. Aham Sarvasya Prabhava. Aham Adirhi Devanam. These things are there, already stated. But the so-called scholars and politicians, they misinterpret in a different way and mislead the people. That is going on. Uh, therefore, uh, in spite of Bhagavad-gītā being read all over the world for the last two hundred years, not a single person became a devotee of Krishna. This is the defect. So let us try to understand Krishna through Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. And as we have repeatedly said, that through Chaitanya Mahaprabhu you understand Krishna and spread this cult all over the world. People are suffering for want of knowledge of Krishna. 
So this moment, especially uh, meant uh, to establish the cult of Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. The cult of Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu is that uh, you become, every one of you, you become a guru. Uh, how to become guru? Jare dakho tare kaho Krishna holy. Simply, that qualification is sufficient. Don't adulterate the Krishna Upadesh. Simply present what Krishna says as it is. Then every one of you will become a guru. Don't adulterate. I think, in my opinion, this nonsense thing should be given up. We should always be aware that we are insignificant creature, our opinion and thinking has no value. This should be the first principle. Why should you give opinion on the words of Krishna? Are you more uh, authoritative person than Krishna? This is foolishness. Uh, to try to become more than Krishna. There are so many rascals, they, they present that now we have advanced, we know more than Krishna. So be saved from these rascals. Then you will understand Krishna, and through Chaitanya Mahaprabhu you will understand what is the position of Krishna, what is your relationship with Krishna? What is the ultimate goal of life? These things will be uh, clearly exhibited. And see, Chaitanya Charitamrita is written for this purpose. Uh, so that a person who is serious about Krishna consciousness may understand Krishna through the mercy of Sri Chaitanya Maha. This is one. Uh, you cannot jump over Krishna consciousness without going through the mercy of Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. Uh, and to go through Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu means to go through the six Goswami. This is parampara system. Uh, therefore, Nartam Das Thakur says, Echaya Gosai Jar Tarmi Das. Tasavara padorenu mora pancha grass. This is parampara system. You cannot jump over. You must go through the parampara system. Uh, you have to approach through your spiritual master to the Goswamis, and through the Goswamis, you will have to approach Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, and through Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, you have to approach Krishna. This is the way. Therefore, uh, mm. mm. Nartam Das Thakur says, Eichaya Gosai Jar Tarumida. We are servant of servant. That is Chaitanya Mahaprabhu's instruction Gopi Bhattu Padakamalayu Dasu Dasu Dasanu Dasu. The more you become servant of the servant, the more you are perfect. And if you all of a sudden want to become master, then you go to hell. Don't do that. This is the teaching of Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. If you go through the sermon, 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 then you are advanced. And if you think that you have now become master, then you are going to hell. This is the process. Dasa dasanu das. Chaitanya Mahaprabhu says. So, sarman, 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 hundred times sarman now, that means he is advanced. He is advanced. And one who is becoming directly master, then he is the hell. So, not with the chering chira. So, we should always remember the instruction of Srila Rupa Goswami. Therefore, we pray, Sri Chaitanya Mano Vishtam Sthapitana Jina Bhutale. 
our mission is to establish the uh, desire of Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. That is our business. Uh, Sri Chaitanya uh, uh, Manovishtam, Sapitanga Jenabhu, Srila Rupa Goswami did it. He has given up so many books, especially Bhakti Rasamrita Sindhu, which we have translated into English as a nectar of devotion, to understand the science of devotional service. This is the greatest contribution of Srila Rupa Goswami, how to become a devotee. Uh, how to become a devotee. Uh, it is not sentiment. Uh, it is science. This Krishna consciousness movement is a great science. So, in the animal life, it is not possible to change one's nature, which is given by uh, the uh, material energy, prakriti, prakriti uh, kriyamana. Karanam guna sangha sap, karanam guna sangha asa sadasad janma junish. Why all living entities are part and parcel of God? Therefore, originally, the characteristic of the living entity is as good as God. Simply, it is a question of uh, quantity. Quality is the same. Uh, quality is the same. Mamai Vang is you. The same example, if you take a drop of sea water, the quality, the chemical composition is the same, but the quantity is different. It is a drop and the sea is vast ocean. Similarly, we are exactly of the same quality as Krishna. We can study why people say God is impersonal. If I am of the same quality, yeah, God is also person. How he can be impersonal? If qualitatively we are one, then as I feel individually, so why God should be refused individuality? This is another nonsense. The impersonal is rascal, they cannot understand what is the nature of God. In the Bible also it is said, man is made after God. You can study God's quality by studying your quality or anyone's quality. Simply the difference is the quantity is different. Uh, I have got some quality, some uh, productive capacity. We also produce. Every individual soul is produces something, but his production cannot be compared with the production of God. That is different. We are producing one flying machine. Uh, we are taking very uh, much pride that now we have discovered the Sputnik, uh, it is going to the moon planet. Uh, but that is not perfect, it is coming back. Uh, but God has produced so many flying planets, uh, millions and trillions of planets, baby, heavy, heavy planets. Just like this planet is uh, carrying so many big, big mountains, sea, but still it is flying. It is floating in the air just like a cotton uh, swath. This is God's power. Gamavishya, uh, in the Bhagavad Gita I will find, Aham Dharayami Ojasa, who is sustaining all these big, big planets. We are explaining gravity. Uh, and when this hastra we find that it is being uh, carried by Shankarsa. Uh, so the quality is the same, uh, 
but the quantity is different. So, because the quality is same, so we have got all the propensities as God has, as Krishna has. Krishna has got loving propensities uh, with his uh, pleasure potency, Srimati Radhara. Similarly, because we are part and parcel of Krishna, we have also got this loving propensity. Uh, so, uh, this is sabhav. But when we come in contact with this material nature, Krishna does not come into the contact of the material nature. Uh, therefore, Krishna's name is Ochuta. He never falls down. But we are prone to fall down. Uh, to be under the uh, prakite uh, kriyamana. Uh, we are now under the influence of prakite. Prakite kriyamana. Gunai karmani uh, As soon as we fall down under the clutches of this prakite, material nature, which means prakite is composed of three qualities, goodness, passion, and ignorance. So we capture one of the qualities. Uh, that is the cause, karanam, guna-saṅga, guna-saṅga, means associating with different qualities. Guna-saṅga, asya, jīva-asya, of the living entity, that is the cause. One can ask that if the living entity is as good as God, why one living entity has become dog and one living entity has become God, devil God? Brahma. The, the answer is karana. The reason is guna sangha asya, asya jivasya, guna sangha. Uh, because he is associating with a particular guna. Uh, Sadagon, Rajagon, Tamagon. So these things are described very vividly in Upanishad. How guna sangha acts. Uh, just like a fire, there are sparks. They sometimes the parts hold down from the fire. Now there are three conditions of the fire spark falling down. If the spark falls down on dry grass, then it can immediately ignite uh, the grass, the dry grass. If the uh, spark falls down on uh, ordinary grass, then it a burns for some time, then again it becomes extinguished. But if this spark falls down on the water, immediately extinguished. The fiery quality. So those who are uh, captured by the satogon, uh, satogon, uh, they are intelligent, they have got knowledge, uh, just like Brahma. Uh, and those who are uh, captured by the rajogon, they are busy in material activities. And those who have captured uh, tamago, they are lazy and sleepy. These are the symptoms. Uh, tamago means they are very lazy and sleepy. Uh, Rajagon means very active, uh, but active like monkey. Just like monkey is very active, but they are all dangerous. As soon as the monkey will never see inactive, wherever it will sit down, it will melt. That, 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 that. So, uh, these are activities, foolish activities. But when one is in goodness, he is sober, he can understand the value of life, how one should live, what is the aim of life, what is the goal of life. Uh, the goal of life is to understand Brahma. Brahma jana titi Brahma. Therefore, the good quality means the Brahma. Uh, similarly, Kshatriya. So they are uh, guna karma vibhaks. Guna. Uh, guna has to be taken into account. Uh, Sri Krishna therefore said, Chatur bannang maya system guna karma vibhaks. We have captured some kind of goal. It is very difficult. But uh, we can immediately transcend all gunas. Immediately. How? 
भाई भक्ति जोग अपना सगुणान समति प्रयतान ब्रह्म भूया कल्प इफ यू टेक द भक्ति बोध जोग अपराश है देन यू आर नो लॉन्ग आर इन्फ्लुएंस बाय आइडर ऑफ दिस थ्री क्वालिटीज गुडनेस पैशन एंड इग्नोर दैट इज आल्सो स्टेटेड इन भगवत गीता मान चब व्या विचारिणी भक्ति जोगी न जो श्रीवती एनी वन हु इज एनगेज in the devotion and service of krishna a baby charity without any deviation <coughs> uh, staunch devout attention uh, such person man jab bhai vicharini jogina man jab bhai vicharini jogina vajate ma sagunan samatit immediately he began uh, transcendental to all the qualities the so devotion and service is not within this material quality they are transcendental a bhakti is transcendental therefore you cannot understand krishna or god without bhakti vaktyamam vijana only vaktyamam vijana otherwise it is not possible vaktyamam vijana ki javan jashami tatva reality in reality if you want to understand what is god Uh, that you have to adopt this bhakti process, uh, devotional service. Then you transcend. Uh, therefore, in the Simad Bhagavatam, Narada says that tatva sadharmam charanam bhujam hari. Uh, if any, anyone, even by sentiment, uh, gives us, gives uh, up his uh, occupational duty according to guru, that is called sadhan. Sadhana means one's duty according to the quality he has acquired. That is called sadhana. The Brahmana, Chhatriya, Vaishya, Sudra, they are divided guna karma vibhaga by guna and karma. So here Arjun says that katpanna dosa apahata sabhava. I am Chhatriya. He understands that I am doing wrong. I am refusing to fight. Therefore, it is start for no dosa. My jal, my jal means I have got some means to spend. But if I don't spend, this is called my jal. Kriponata. So kriponata. There are two classes of man: Brahman and Sudra. Brahman and Sudra. Brahman means he is not my jal. He has got the opportunity, great asset of this human form of body, uh, many millions of dollars worth. This human, but he is not using it properly. Uh, simply seeing it, how beautiful it is. Uh, thus, spend your beauty, uh, or utilize your asset, the human. That is Brahman to be liberated. एक प्रयाति सा ब्राह्मण वन हु नो फुलाक मानस थे दुर्लभक मानस में जन्म अध्रुवम अक्षदम ही वॉज प्रीचिंग अमाउंट हिज क्लास फ्रेंड्स ही वॉज बॉर्न इन ए डिमोनिक फैमिली हिरण्यक एंड हिज क्लास फ्रेंड्स ऑफ्सो ऑफ द सेम कैटेगरी So Pallad Maharaj was advising them, my dear brothers, uh, let us cultivate Krishna consciousness. Uh, so other boys, what do they know about Krishna consciousness? Pallad Maharaj is liberated from the very birth. So they say, what is this Krishna consciousness? Uh, they could not understand. So he was convincing them: "Dur lava ka man sanga janma tadopi." अधुर्वम अर्थद दिस ह्यूमन बॉडी इज दुर्लभ लब्धा सुदुर्लभम इज ऑम बहु संभव दिस ह्यूमन फॉर्म ऑफ बॉडी इज ए ग्रेट कॉन्सेशन गिवन बाय द मेटीरियल नेच पीपल आर सो मिसक्रिएंट एंड फुलिस 
they do not understand what is the value of this human form. They engage this body for sense gratification like cats and dogs. The Shastra therefore says, no, this human form of body is not meant for uh, spoiling like the hogs and dogs. Prayang deha, deho hajang nilo. Everyone has got a body, material body. But nilo, in the human society, this body is not to be spoiled. Prayang, prayang deha. Deho bhajam in rupi. Kastana kaman arhati virbhujanji. This human form of life is simply working uselessly hard day and night for sense gratification. This is the business of the hog and dog. They are doing also the same thing. Whole day and night working hard simply for sense gratification. So, therefore, in the human society, uh, there must be a system of division that is called Varnasamdha. That is Vedic civilization. That is real called Arya Samaj. Arya Samaj does not mean to become rascal and fool and deny the existence of God. No. That is an arjan. Oh. Just like Krishna rebuked ah, Arjan, an arjan is you are talking like onarja, one who is not Krishna conscious, uh, is onarja. Onarja Arja means who is advanced in Krishna consciousness. So really arja Saman means Krishna conscious person, otherwise bogus, bogus arja Saman. Because here from the Bhagavad Gita I say, Krishna says Arjuna, rebuking, because he was refusing to fight, because he does not know what is his duty, again Arjuna is admitting here that Kattvanda Guru Sopahata Sabah. Yes, uh, I am anarch, I become anarch, because I have forgotten my duty. Uh, so, actually Arjuna Saman means Krishna conscious society, international society for Krishna. There is Arjuna, not bogus. So here uh, Arjuna is explaining, putting himself, yes, tatpana dosa, because I am forgetting my duty. Uh, therefore, avata sabhava, uh, I am builder in my natural propensities. Uh, I mean, should be uh, always active. Whenever there is a war, there is fight, they must be very much enthusiastic. Uh, a khatriya, if another khatriya says, I want to fight with you, he, or he cannot refuse. Oh. Yes, come on, fight, take so, uh, immediately come on. That is khatriya. Uh, now he is refusing to fight, therefore he can understand, he can stand this side, not in front. Uh, <coughs> he is forgetting his duty, khatriya duty. Uh, therefore he is admitting, yes, satpanna dusho apahatsabhav, my natural duty I am forgetting, therefore I have become miser. Uh, so when you become miser, that is a disease condition, <coughs> then what is your duty? Then go to a person who can, just like when you become disease, you go to a physician and ask him what to do, sir. I am not suffering with this disease. This is your duty. Similarly, when we are perplexed in our duties or we forget our duties, it is uh, very nice to go to the uh, superior person and ask him what to do. So who can be superior person than Krishna? Uh, therefore Arjuna says, Prichyami Tva, I am asking you. Uh, because it is my duty, I am now uh, falling in my duty, faulty. So this is not good. Uh, Sai Masa, ask uh, somebody who is superior to me. Uh, that is the duty. Tad Vijnana Thamsa Guru Meva This is the basic duty. Uh, 
Everyone is perplexed. Everyone is suffering in this material world, being perplexed. But he will not search out a bona fide guru. No. Uh, that is Karpanna Dusha. That is Karpanna Dusha. Here Ojo is coming out of the Karpanna Dusha. Uh, how? He is asking Krishna. Prichyami Tvam, my dear Krishna, you are the most superior person that I know, your Krishna. So I am perplexed. Actually, I am forgetting my duty. Therefore, I am asking you. So you have to approach the Supreme Person, means Krishna or his representative. All others are rascals and fools. If you approach a person, Guru, who is not representative of Krishna, you are approaching a rascal. How will be like? You must approach Krishna or his representative. That is one. So, who is Guru? Samit Pani Sutriyam Brahmanistham. A Guru is full Krishna concept. Brahmanistha. Uh, and Srotriyam. Srotriyam means who has heard, who has received knowledge by the Srotriyam Partha, by hearing from superior authority. Evam parampara praptam, imam rajal sayogidu. So here we have to learn from Arjuna that when we are perplexed, when we forget our real duty, and therefore we are puzzled, then our duty is to approach Krishna as Arjuna is. Uh, so if you say, where is Krishna? Krishna is not there, but Krishna's representative is there. Uh, you should approach him. That is the basic intention. Tadvigyanatham sa guru meva vivatsi. One must approach guru. Uh, and guru means Krishna, original. Uh, Guru Tini Brahma Rida Adikavai Muyanti Jat Surayo Janma Adrasya Jataha Annaya Tita Datascha Arthesu Avigna Sara. You have to approach. Uh, uh, that is Guru. Uh, so we consider, we take Brahma because he is the first creature within this universe. He is accepted as the Guru. Uh, he uh, imparted, just that like we belong to the Brahma Sampradaya. There are uh, four Sampradayas, Brahma Sampradaya, Sri Sampradaya, Rudra Sampradaya, and Kumara Sampradaya. They are all Mahajan. Mahajana Jena We have to accept the line of action which is uh, given by the Mahajan. So Brahma is Mahajan. You will find Brahma's picture uh, with Veda in his hand. Uh, see, he, gave, he gave the first instruction of Veda. <coughs> but where from he got the Vedic knowledge? Uh, therefore, Vedic knowledge is apurasya. It is not man-made. Uh, it is uh, God-made. Dharmantu sakshadu bhagavatpanita. So, how God Krishna gave to Brahma, Tini Brahma Rida. Brahma, Brahma means the Vedic knowledge. So the Brahma, Tini, he injected Vedic knowledge from Rida. Tisam satatu yuktanang bhajatang priti When Brahma was created, he was perplexed. What is my duty? Everything is dark. So he meditated. And Krishna gave him knowledge that your duty is this, to do like this. Tene Brahma Rida Adikavai, Adikavai, Brahma is Adikavai. So, actual Guru is Krishna. And here Krishna is advising the Bhagavad Gita, these rascals and fools will not accept Krishna as Guru. They will go to some rascal and fool and miscreants, sinful person and accept Guru. How you can be Guru? So, Guru is Krishna. Here is the example given by Arjuna. Uh, 
Vichyami Tma, who is that now? Krishna. Oh. Why you are asking me? Dharma Sangamura Sita. I am builder in my duty. Dharma. Dharma means duty. Dharma Shashad Bhagavat Sangamura Sita. So, what I have to do? Just say what is actually my duty, Shreya. Shreya and Priya. Priya, there are two things. Priya means which I like immediately. Very nice. Uh, and Shreya means ultimate goal. There are two things. Let's take a child wants to play all day. Uh, that is childish nature. That is Shreya. And Priya means he must take education so that in future his life will be settled. That is prayer. Uh, say. So Arjuna is asking not prayer. Uh, he is asking instruction from Krishna, not for the purpose of confirming his Sreya. Sreya means immediately he was thinking that I shall be happy by not fighting, not by killing my kinsmen. That he was uh, like a child he was thinking. But when he came to his consciousness, uh, not actually consciousness because his intelligence, he is asking for prayer, uh, uh, shreya, just shreya, syat. Uh, what is actually my ultimate goal of life? Just shreya, syat. Just shreya, syat, nishchitam. Nishchitam means. Uh, fixed up, without any mistake, nishtita. Mm. Uh, in Bhagavad there is called nishtita. Nishtita means you, you haven't got to make research. It is already settled up. This is the decision. Uh, so because we are with our teeny brain, we cannot find out what is the actual nishtita fixed up shreya. That we do not know. That you have to ask from Krishna. All is represented. These are the things. Jatche asyad nishchitam bruhi ton me. Say this kindly. Uh, speak to me that. Uh, so why shall I speak to you? Uh, uh, and here says, uh, Shishya seham. Uh, now I am accepting you as my guru. I become your shishya. Shisha means whatever you will say, I will accept. That is Shisha. The Shisha word comes from Sasdhaku. Sasdhaku. Shastra. Oh. Shastra. Shasan. Shisha. These are from the same root. Sasdhaku. Oh. Sasdhaku means rule, ruling. Uh, so we can rule in various ways. Uh, we can be ruled. Becoming a shisha uh, or a proper guru, uh, that is sasdha. Or we can be ruled by shastra, weapon. Uh, the king has got weapon. If you don't follow the king's instruction or government instruction, then there is police uh, force, military force, that is shastra. And there is shastra. Shastra means book. Scripture, that's like Bhagavad Gita. Everything is there. So we must be ruled either by Shastra, Shastra, or Guru, or becoming Shisha. Therefore it is said, Shisha Sthira, I become voluntarily. I surrender unto you. So you become Shisha, what is the proof that you have become my Shisha? Shadhi Mang Swang Prabhannam. Now I am fully silent. Purpan. Uh, so this knowledge requires how to find out real Guru and how to surrender unto Him. Uh, the Guru does not mean that I keep a Guru uh, so as order supplier. Uh, my dear Guru, I am suffering from this. Can you give me some medicine? Yes, yes. Take this. Yes. <coughs> Not that good. Uh, 
if you are suffering from some disease, you go out to a physician. It is not Guru's business uh, to give you some medicine. Uh, Guru's business is to give you Krishna. Krishna says, Tomar Krishna Dite Pat. Uh, a Vaishna is praying Guru. Sir, uh, you are devotee of Krishna. Uh, you can give me Krishna if you like. This is the position of Shishya. Guru's business is how to give you Krishna, not any material thing. For material things there are so many uh, institutions. Uh, but if you want Krishna, then Guru is required. Uh, who, is, who requires a Guru? Tasmat Gurum Prapadita Jignasu Sreya Uttamam Sabde Parechanishnatam Brahmani Upasamasrayam. Who requires a guru? Guru is not a fashion. I have got a guru. I shall make a guru. Uh, guru means one who is serious. Tasmat Guru Prabhupada. One has to seek out a guru. Why? Jigyasu uh, Sreya Uttamam. One who is inquisitive and the supreme. Uh, not guru make a fashion, just like we keep a dog. Fashion. Similarly, we keep a guru. That is not guru. Uh, <coughs> guru will act according to my decision. Not like that. Guru means uh, one who can give you Krishna. Uh, that is good. Uh, Krishna says Tomar, because Krishna is guru. Uh, that is stated in the Brahma Sangha. Bede sudur lava, adur lava apu bhakto. Bede sudur lava. If you want to search out, although Vedas means knowledge, and the ultimate knowledge is to understand Krishna. Veda is to sarvai ahameva vidyam. This is the instruction. So, if you independently want to study Vedas, that there, is, there are some rascals, they say, that we understand only Veda. And what do you understand Veda? I will understand Veda. So Veda says that Vijnanatham sa guru me eva gacche. You will understand Veda by taking one, purchasing one Veda's book or taking anything, you will understand Veda. Uh, Veda is not so cheap thing. Uh, without becoming a Brahmana, nobody can understand a Veda. What is Veda? Therefore it is strict. Without becoming Brahmana, nobody is allowed to study Veda. It's all nonsense. What do you will understand about the Veda? So therefore, in order to achieve the highest goal of life, one should fully surrender to Krishna or his representative, then his life is successful. Thank you.